<laughs> I can't stand you, bro. Alright. Okay, there we go. My computer be moving so damn slow. I got I gotta delete some stuff, bro. Reporting live from the federal. Da, da, da. Uh, we live, y'all. We live. I'm really trying to force myself to stay up so I can get my sleep schedule back on track. I've been trying, bro. <laughs> you so silly. Oh, everybody tuning in. What's up, everybody? We jumped to 50 quick. Doing what you know best. You already know it, man. We about to draw that boy Scorpion. Let me see. I need to goddamn make his head a little bigger. I'm in here with the game. My bro Self One and my sister Neat Natural. You feel me? <laughs> I'm gonna punch you dead in your face. <laughs> Trying to make sure I got. All right, I'm drawing this for a customer, y'all. He just paid me to draw him Scorpion. So you know, the boy had to make it happen. Yeah, they be showing love. Oh, sometimes it take me like an hour or two. It just depends on how much detail I'm trying to put into the picture. So, it just depends. I got a custom uh, color palette. I need to make a goddamn. Hmm? Nah, I, I really want to get with somebody that really can build them. Like, I can just make it and they can, you know what I'm saying, put it inside the program and jump. Right, right. That'll be crazy. Yeah, copy that. I think this the, this the, uh, out of all the characters, bro, I think this the character that represents Motor Combat the best, bro. Of course, it's the most important. I promise. And if anybody got any kill, let me know that's your fault. <laughs> 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 let me stop lying. Hey, do you play? You play Warframe, Stephon? Warframe. Not bro, I ain't gonna lie. Today, I was just watching it. I, I'm thinking about starting back playing it, bro. Yeah, I'm thinking about starting it back. Broski, appreciate you for the donation, Broski. I ain't forgot about you neither, bro. I know you wanted We still talking about that, uh, that artwork. That's going to be crazy. Oh, he used to watch me in his uh, graphic design class? That's dope. That's amazing. Let me 
me see. I need to bring his uh his face a little too short. Let me see. We're gonna pull this whole piece up like this. And we're gonna drag it up like this. Probably right now. Nah, we'll keep it about right there. Get over here. I'm finna uh I'm finna release my website probably like tomorrow or the day after tomorrow and it's gonna have like how you can purchase your own cartoon heads and stuff like that. So that's what we've been working on. So I said I'm gonna make a video probably tonight or tomorrow. So y'all can just introducing the website. And the designer that uh, helped me did everything. I really didn't have to do nothing. She just built it from scratch for me. So I'm going to be showing how y'all can reach out to her and get y'all websites made. If you want to start, start your own personal business and stuff like that. So I'm going to make a video on it probably tomorrow just explaining everything. And so for all the people that's been trying to buy a cartoon head so you can see your personal cartoon head on my youtube channel you'll know how to do it because it'll have all the instructions showing you step by step how you can make your purchase and you know what i'm saying place your order and get you a cartoon head from your boy your fiercenes i'm using a, a digital art tablet right now I'm drawing straight on the tablet. I'm going to drop a video soon using the mouse. I know y'all want to start seeing more videos of me just using the mouse. So we'll drop a video. Yep, because man, don't play stupid. <laughs> 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 She's so stupid. <laughs> My super crazy, bro. But yeah, I'm going to make a video using the mouse so y'all can... uh. See how your boy do it with the mouse. Okay, let me um make this little head come out a little further like this. You know what this remind me of? Who did who? What character this remind you of? Video game wise. Other than Motor Comeback, it's a it's a whole different game. It remind me of uh, Assassin Creed for some reason. Just just this picture, like what I got so far. It just put me. It put me in the mind of Assassin Creed. Huh? No, nah, I'm talking about like just him in the hoodie and just the way it, the pose is. He just remind me of Assassin Creed. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, Deadpool. appreciate y'all y'all inspire me so it's like we give off the same energy back and forth y'all inspire y'all say i inspire y'all but y'all really inspire me like i be so excited to get on here and draw something and show you guys and let you just watch me do what i love and hopefully you doing what you love while you watching me and we just motivating each other to get better and what we love to do we love to create And this is kind of like my escape place, too, because I know this doing art is like a getaway from reality, you know what I'm saying? Because there's so much craziness going on in the world where I feel like they're trying to divide us as a people. So it's good to have something we all can relate on, you know what I'm saying? So I love doing, doing stuff on my channel, like drawing live and stuff and just 
seeing the chat filled with all these different types of people you know what i'm saying and we all got a mutual love for art like we all can relate that we love and and we respect each other for our talents you know what i'm saying and we all together that's what i feel like when i come to my channel i feel like the world is trying to segregate people but when i get on my youtube channel you just see a whole lot of people that's all for each other no matter what race we all like got a mutual respect for for one another and we all one you know what i'm saying so that's why i really like i'm starting to really like to get on my live for uh, just deeper than what it used to be i used to want to get on live just to show you guys or try to teach but now it's, it's becoming more of a spiritual healing for me so just seeing people work together seeing people just want to be together all races you know what i'm saying um the tablet with the display i'm telling you soon as i got a tablet with the display i start really loving digital art like i used to draw every now and then when i just had a tablet using like where you got to look at the the monitor and it didn't have a display screen on it i used to draw every now and then but soon as i got one where you can look straight at the screen and you can draw like i just fell in love with it i was like yes oh this is crazy nah the brand don't matter <clears throat> the brand do not matter because i'm telling you i just wanted one i didn't care if it was made by goddamn great value i just wanted a tablet so i really just when i first bought this art tablet i'm still using it like i just got on amazon and i found the cheapest tablet i can find and it was still sort of expensive at the time because it was like four four hundred dollars i think and i just got it and then when it came in i was shoot i loved it and then you got to think if you're not using if you're not used to using a digital art tablet your first art tablet gonna be amazing to you anyway Like if you just if you transition if yeah if you're transitioning from using a mouse, anything you get will be better than just using your mouse. So you gonna you just gonna be happy that you got something. So first I started with the one you don't have the strain on it. Then I got the upgraded to this one. <clears throat> Hopefully. We get sponsored by one of these art tablets and they send us one. <laughs> Cause it's about time for me to upgrade. Cause I was thinking about <clears throat> I was thinking about buying the Wacom, but then I'm thinking like I might as well just use this one to the wheels fall off before I upgrade. You know what I'm saying? Oh, because it was cheap. This is the first one I. This is the first digital art tablet I ever bought. I'm still using it. Cause really, it ain't about what you use. It's about how you using it. To be honest, to be flat out truthful, <clears throat> I want to upgrade just because I'm addicted to buying new things. But to be truthful with you guys, like. You don't. You ain't gotta spend a lot of money <clears throat> to get the best equipment. You just, really, you can just use what you got and make the best of it. You know what I'm saying? For real. Cause you can buy a ten thousand dollar art tablet, but if you still ain't practicing and and working on your craft it's gonna be somebody that's using a twenty dollar art tablet that can make more amazing pictures than you can so it ain't about what you use and it's about how you using it and it's about who using it so 
get what you can afford and master your craft and don't let nothing be your excuse of why you can't got thing do what you love so you got to start get what you can anything you can get to get started <clears throat> whatever you can get to get get started that's the goal Um, nah, not yet, but I, I will be working on that, you know what I'm saying, to make other options where you can purchase it. I might try to, I might go ahead and try to make, like, revamp the skin palette and, like, sell it on Amazon or something, but make it bigger. I'm going to sit down and make it bigger. And call it like uh what you call it like like the ultimate pack where it got like thousands of skin tones and transitions but i would really have to take some time off and really work on some colors because i'm like ocd when it comes to making colors like to be honest Let me see. That's I think that's a pretty nice sketch. What you think of my sketch, Monique? <clears throat> it's looking nice. Bushy. <laughs> 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 Y'all do <the> play. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nah, you got to get her before she get you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I got the whole personality from her, bro. Let's see, bro. Nah. <laughs> I, got it. I got it from her, bro. Yeah, that's coming soon too. I'm selling uh I got a little Teespring store. I'm finna start uploading a lot of my work on Teespring. But I really I really wanna branch out like the end of this year, I'm telling you guys, you're gonna see a lot of Chi World merch where you can buy a lot of my artwork because I'm really like when I'm not live, I'm working on art pieces. Because I really want to get into selling posters. I want to transition as an artist while I'm just selling a lot of, of my work. You know what I'm saying? Because I want, I want people to fill their whole house up with my artwork, to be honest. That's like, a, that's like a goal of mine. Just to see my art everywhere. Like, where people just love my art. So... Yeah, I'm using the tablet. I'm using the UG right now. I don't even think they make the UGs no more. I think they've been discontinued, but I'm pretty sure you can find something similar because I think they're pretty much all the same. They just got different names. Art tablets is just like them cereal. You know how they got the, the Fruity Loops and then they got the knockoff Fruity Loops, but they still Fruity Loops. They just got a different brand on them. That's that's how Art Tablets is nowadays. To be honest. Did I go to any art school? <clears throat> no, I didn't go to art school. Look at my sister done made it. <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get up for real, bro. Nah, I never went to no art. Thank you though. Thank you, big sis. She always showing love. But look, I never went to art school. But coming up, that's what that was a dream of mine. I always wanted to go to an art school because I feel like that's what I needed. I was like, man, if I go to art school, that'll be I used to see it as a form of success. Like if I go, if I can make it to an art school, I can be, I can find a job in art. You know what I'm saying? But 
the time we living in, man, you don't even need you don't even you don't even need school. If you are already know what you want to do, unless you going to be something you got to go to school for, like a doctor or a lawyer, something like that, yeah, you have to go to school. But as far as you want to be anything like entrepreneur wise, like as an artist, like whether it's a music artist or dance artist, whatever you trying to be, I think you can do that yourself. And the same money you would use to pay to go to school, you can be using to invest into starting your career. So. Yeah, a form of validation. Because at one point in time, trust me, I used to think, man, I got to go to school. I got to go see, I got to get my work judged by different professors and all kinds of stuff, but never went to school. So if I never went to school and I'm doing this for a living, I think, shoot, all you really got to do is keep God first, stay working hard, and believe in yourself to make your dream a reality. And you got to understand it ain't easy and it's not guaranteed. Nothing in life is guaranteed. So you can go to school thinking, man, I'm going to go to school just so I can be guaranteed that everything going to work out right. But you can go to school and still not work in the field that you went to school for. You know what I'm saying? You can get your master's in art and still wind up not working as an artist. Hey y'all. Add Chris to the call. <laughs> he calling me now. But tell him, hey, now nah, text him and tell him please don't be saying nothing crazy, bro, because I'm lying. <laughs> Self one the canceling king though. <laughs> Bro, do not play no games. But yeah, man. I used to think, man, I got to go to school for art. And just a disclaimer, um, for anybody going to school, there's no, there's no hidden job going to school. Yeah, and now if you already in school and you still want to go to school... It still can be a great thing. Now, don't let me don't don't let me try to make it seem like school is a bad thing because it's everybody got their own paths. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to say don't go to school and school wind up post like that's your path. Like if you feel like that's the route you want to take, I mean take that route. G. Hmm. G. I see you in your laptop. Hmm. G. I see you in your laptop. Okay. You take it to him. Yeah, whatever whatever route you think you, you want to take, I think you should take that route. Because either way it go, if you do go to school, if you if you're going to school to learn about the fundamentals of art, now that's cool too, because you do got a lot of professors in art that's really can teach you the fundamentals and you can take those fundamentals and you can create your own way. So yeah, you, you you can get some good learning about school. But if you wanna save money, you can teach yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like you can get on YouTube because everything I learned, I just went, I really just, I got on YouTube You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we in it. What's up, Chris? What's up, broski? We live. You want to help read read some comments, Chris? <laughs> Hey, can y'all hear me? Is is my mic? Do my mic sound good on the live? Yeah, it's clear. Okay, 
I'm just making sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it turned up. But yeah, man. We living in a generation where you can really take advantage of everything that you already got for free. Like, you got internet for free. That means you can reach millions of people. You got platforms where you can advertise yourself on. You can advertise your work. Because if you want to be an artist, uh, as far as a well-known artist online, all you have to do is stay promoting yourself online. Just treat your work like it's a show and tell, and treat your uh, just treat your Facebook and your Instagram as as an art gallery. You know what I'm saying? Like when I post on my my Instagram and stuff like that, I just put in my mind like this is an art gallery as soon as i post this people gonna look at it like they they really at an art show you know what i'm saying and it's advertising your work what'd you say it again Oh, yo, we'll do that. We'll do that. Go live one day where we're critiquing different people's Instagram to make sure. Make sure it's all focused on one thing. Yeah, know, making sure they're going the right route yeah, with it. Yeah. I think that'll be dope. What day you think we should do that to really like? Yeah, that'll be dope. Just to make sure. And I'll make sure I let y'all know too so everybody who want me to critique, they like Instagram live. Y'all will have a chance to, you know, send me your at name and stuff like that. Let's see, bring this over. Who? Oh, my boy, Lay. Yeah, I think you're here, bro. I got a I link. See what? I see Where he at? He in chat. Yeah, he said hello. Here. Oh, that was up, broski in here. I got a link up with him anyway. This summer, I promise, we all linking together this summer. Yeah, we got a lot of work to do. I promise you, bro. It's going to be turned up this summer. I'm talking about. Oh, I was about to say, if y'all would like something like that, put some art palettes in the comments. They already pulling up saying they they like they like that. Oh yeah, that'll be a do- okay. We'll do it. It's set in stone. But yeah, this summer, bro, I know we're gonna do a lot of work, but also gonna do a lot of playing too. But paintball on deck. Oh yeah. I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to get that. All the, all the <laughs> nah, I guess what Tierra want to do, bro. She want to go skydiving, dog. Ooh, that one thing I ain't do. <laughs> uh-huh. I, I want to live it up, but I don't want to live it that far up, bro. You feel me? Like nah, she want to go jump out of that damn moving plane, bro. Yeah, so y'all hit the light. Yeah. I like she trying to yeah, go. Your locks got to be in the hat first. Yeah, she trying to go crazy. I'm the type that want to bail out at the last minute. We'll be in the air, and the dude will be trying to jump us out the plane, and I'll be holding us back. <laughs> like, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> bro, I'm going to knock you out, bro. For real. For real, dude, like you out. But yeah, I do want to go around the racetrack though on them go cars.
Anime overlay. What's that? Anime overlay. What's up? What's an animated overlay? Oh, you talk like a moving cartoon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, bro. I don't really, do, I don't really do that, but I do the art for it. And you can find somebody. What a lot of people do is they'll come buy the art from me, and then they'll go to a. They'll go to an animator to get it moved to make it move. Huh? Who said that? Oh, she playing. I still, I still would have to, I still would have to sit down and learn how to do it. Like I, I be like, I wouldn't want to take somebody's money and still not know like what to do. But I can do the art for it, and he take it somewhere, and, uh, cause that's very time consuming. Unless you really know what you're doing. Like, it's a lot of animators that really know shortcuts and all that. But me, since I don't know nothing, I would have to draw each frame, each page frame by frame. All right, all right. Don't put yourself down. I ain't going to sit there for that. Huh? My own comics? Nah, but I am thinking about writing a book. Okay. I'm thinking about writing a book for real. Like, not about myself, like, not about me. Just what people can read for the people who really just want to know, like, how to get their own career started. Even though I talk about it a lot, just put it in a book where people can just look at it by it themselves. No, nah, I'm just saying. <laughs> 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 Bro, me and my sister gonna no, fight, bro. I don't want to read it. You better give me a video. I'll, I'll watch but nah, you know what? I'm gonna give videos and I'm gonna make a book just for the people who like to watch. Cause you got people who like like to learn visually, and then you got people who like to really sit down and read and learn that way. So just to try to be try to be versatile. Try, just try to be versatile, <laughs> bro. I'm gonna beat my sister. Up. Said audiobook, yeah, audio book. That'd be dope. Yeah, like a, like a In other words, if anyone want to read, thank you. I'm a, I'm a, I get the book. I like. Yeah, see there, see there. Some people like to read. You know what though? What? If you were to be the one to talk over your audio book, like it's personal, it's coming from you. Then I'll be like, all right, bro, go to chapter five. <laughs> nah, I can't be the person to read. Wait, that that probably would be dope, though. But you a rapper, though. All right, man. All right. Rap, hey, my rap voice different from my reading voice. I'll be like, yo, Which chapter seven. <laughs> Yeah, that would be fire too. Now that's dope. Make a visual. Oh yeah, I'm cool. I'm cool with that. That would be fire. Mm -hmm. Okay, look at y'all creative minds working. I hear you, but you don't hear me though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this thing is gonna be fire though. But yeah, man. Your boy used to think he had to go to school. Like my dream before I like figured out how to make art work for me, I used to want to work for Cartoon Network.
I used to real deal try to work for Cartoon Network. Like when I first came up here, I came up here with a whole box of art and stuff, and I was trying to goddamn just walk in and Cartoon Network and let them see it. Like, but then when I got up there, I realized you can't just walk in Cartoon Network, bro. <laughs> they ain't gonna let yes, you. you can. I tried, yes, bro. I was up there, bro. They ain't gonna let that happen. I real deal went up there. I was like, I swear on everything. I look cartoon Cartoon Network is stationed in a, in Atlanta. Oh okay. So I went up there and it's like, shoot, it's like trying to get in the White House. You real, you real did, yeah. You real did. Got to already, it already got to be. I ain't, I ain't know it was that type of place. I thought it would be like if you trying to work at goddamn Walmart or something. You just walk in and you show your resume. I just thought about it though. Partly, Tune Network, that would have people like copyright, license, property. You know, they of course they got to have it online. Yeah, I was like, bro, I'm gonna walk up here. Cause I was already thinking in my, my my mind. I was like, man, I can draw anything. I know for a fact they'll give me a job. But see, everything work out. Like that wasn't that wasn't my path. Come to find out, like I wouldn't even want to work for nobody to be for real. Fast forward to now, like I want my partner in and doing work with a company, but I wouldn't want to work for for nobody. Appreciate you being G. Um, so creative. Uh, yeah, that's uh, that's that's how the dog so creative talking in the chat. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah. You said that's you. It's about to be turned up, man. Go ahead. Draw this like that. I do a lot. I'm looking at a reference. I'm looking at a reference right now. Let me see. Um, all we gotta do is just draw this like that. But yeah, this summer, man, we need to have a big old reunion. A squad reunion. Um, I like to use other than Illustrator, I like to use Procreate and Clip Studio Paint. Okay. I think Clip Studio Paint is pretty dope too. Like as far as if you want to still have a program that's like Illustrator, but give you the best of both both worlds. If you want to do like realistic type of shading, uh, Clip Studio Paint would be super dope. And then Procreate, that's I think that's fire too. It's super fire if you're using like a, a iPad or you're using like a Android tablet. I think they got it on Android. I'm not sure. I shouldn't even say that. Oh, Monique with the bit. Bro, where you getting all this money from, bro? <laughs> you balling. You feel me? Appreciate it. So man, I just noticed you had that up there. Superman. Let me see. Yeah. On Procreate, does the canvas on matter to get your artwork free? On Procreate, uh, my favorite size to draw on, just me personally, is a uh, 18 by 24. Like when I'm when I know I'm finna make a poster, cause I I really like big 
art. You know what I'm saying? So, but if I'm not gonna make it to a poster and I'm just trying to upload to like Instagram and stuff like that, the size I draw on inside of uh, Procreate will be 18 by 18 inches. Just so my lines don't look so pixelated. Over there, like that. We gonna run this. It did. That's done fire. No, bro. Nah, they said uh, that order going to be, for some reason, they keep saying it's going to be late. And they ain't even going to take my money out of my account until it come. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah, like, bro. COVID got everything crazy, bro. Yeah, COVID got everything crazy, for real. You know when you order something, bro, you be got that. As soon as you click order, like, <laughs> you be feeling like it's supposed to come in right then, bro. We're supposed to be in a box already packed up. Wait, bro, I be, st I be stalking on the internet every five seconds. I'm like, dang, how far is it? You got some love from India. Much love to India, man. I'm gonna visit all these places one day before, before it's all said and done. I'm gonna visit every place known to me. For real. I'm gonna ask y'all. I'm gonna be like, hey, y'all trying to come? I'm finna go. I'm finna go to such and such. I'm finna go to. I'm finna go to Dubai. And as soon as y'all be like, I don't know. I'm gonna already be on the plane. I'm gonna be like, all right, yeah, catch our next trip. Bro, I'm gonna be like, you talking to T-World. Everybody gonna have their own thing to do, though. I'm like, well, tell your boss you're sick. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, I'm gonna say, yeah, call, I'm gonna say call in sick. I dang sure yeah, I wanna go to Tokyo. Yeah. Man, we gonna be living life, man. You only get one. Y'all only get one, you feel me? Okay, this thing coming out pretty dope. I'm right, we gonna put this over here. Like man, that's what's up, man. Go get your money, bro. And stay doing what you're doing, man. And Wally said, I updated Procreate five times yesterday. iCloud, Drop Files, first stuff. Oh, yeah. Procreate is a, is a beast, bro. To be just an app, like a, a, a app on your iPad and stuff like that, it's a super dope program. Because I got so many pictures I framed just that I drew off Procreate. It's crazy. Yeah. So Craig said you need to do a live seminar drawing with a with a audience. With an audience. Oh, that'll be fire. That'll be fire. Who said that? Who you said said that? So creative. So creative. That's dope. That's a dope idea. I'm a real deal. Write that down in my notes. All credit goes to you. I wasn't even thinking of that. How you do it? Um, it just depends. It's different ways to approach it. It's different ways you can approach dreads. 
And I got a couple of videos on my channel where I drew a lot of different people that got dreads. And you'll just, if you go through my videos, you'll see the different style of dreads and the ways I approached it. But yeah, it's a lot of ways you can approach it, man. One thing I noticed about his mask, it ain't all the way neat, so I ain't gotta make this so perfect. Go ahead, put little scratches on it, you know what I'm saying? Like that to make it look like it been beat up. But yeah, this summer is going down, bro. I might. I might block this whole summer. What 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 you said? They the only only for now. I ain't hear what you said. The only for now. They the only wait, question. Only for now. Hey, did you know? Oh yeah, I think that? so. I'm live to you. Okay. I'll just let you know. Oh, I know, I know, I heard you. You good, bro? Yeah, I'm good. I said I heard you. Oh, you just sound like you got an attitude. <laughs> Oh, that was weird, but what's up? I was just letting you know so you ain't come in saying nothing crazy. I just, I let everybody know that. Huh? The phone started messing up. I couldn't hear what you said, bro. My bad. Wait, say it, say it again. Cause my junk, my junk, tripping, tripping. Oh, program clip studio paint. What about it? Um, what version did I get? I would say if you got it, go ahead and get.